This is a demonstration of the rad eye in an alarm state as viewed through the viewpoint web client. I'm zoomed into my location and I'm showing the rad eye icon here in the center of the screen. If I hover over the rad eye, I can see information about the state of the rad eye, including its serial number, location, current count rate, and last report time. If I click on the show in window button, that information will remain in a window. I can then remove that window from the rad eye icon and move it to a corner of the screen. So if I have multiple rad eyes in an array, it will be easy to view all of that information at the same time. What I'm doing now is putting a couple of radioactive sources on the rad eye to make it go into an alarm state. You can now see that the rad eye just went into an alarm state as noted by the rad eye icon surrounded by red. You can also see the information in the window has changed to a level 1 alarm with the red level 1 text now displayed. All these things, including the colors of the icon and what is displayed in the window, are all configurable. You can see the counts are changing and they currently read 33 counts per second and it is displaying a level 1 alarm. If I provide more source, you'll see more counts come in in a few seconds. Actually, I think it's become saturated by these two small sources I used initially. That shows you what the rad eye would look like in an alarm state using the viewpoint web client. I'm now going to remove those sources so we can show the alarm disappear. So there you go. It just went below its alarm threshold and now the rad eye icon changed back to its original state and the count rate has gone back below the threshold. You can also notice that the alarm indication on the window has disappeared as well. That was a quick demonstration of a rad eye PRD going into an alarm state as shown on Viewpoint Web Client. Thank you, and I hope you found this demonstration helpful and informative. For more information, visit thermofisher.com slash radiation measurement or email us at customerservice.rmsi at thermofisher.com.